YouTube, it's me, Jen, your Pudgy Picker, here again, this time with a haul. I love doing hauls, but this one is from Dumpsters. Found some awesome good stuff, and I wanted to show it to you. Uh, if you are new to my channel, consider subscribing. And I also do lots of garage sales, auction hauls, thrift store hauls, ride-alongs, and some DIYs. I am a reseller on eBay, as well as I have a space in an antique mall. So some of this I will be using for uh, that purpose. A lot of this stuff will be donated. We have what are called little pantries. If you Google it, you can find some in your area. So if you don't have a food bank that's close by, you can take food there. And it's just like a little box on the side of the road. You open up the door, put pantry items as well as personal care items uh, into there. And uh, it's for people to come by and take what they need. So a lot of this will go to that. So let's jump right in and I'll show you what I got. So uh, I will show you what I got at CVS first. That is most of the stuff you see here. I have two, bo two bags of glazed mini donuts, a white chocolate macadamia nut, just one of those, a Cheerios. The side seam is split open, but the bag is, inta is intact inside. Three of these Cheez-It snapped uh, I guess it's like a chip. There's two sour cream, cheddar, sour cream, and onion, and that one is double cheese. Got three packages of cheese flavored puffs. That is their brand is the gold emblem. We got one, two, three, four, five, six of these berry edamame blend. So it's kind of like a uh, like a trail mix essentially. Two of these. Uh, crafted Gourmet Almonds Garlic Herb and Olive Oil. Sounds pretty good. Regular price was $5.49. Two of those. And one, two, three, four of the uh, pistachios. Not in a shell. They are honey roasted. I like pistachios, but I kind of just like them the way they are. So, I don't know. So there's a little package of those that are just the... No, actually, those are honey roasted as well. So a lot of these, like I said, will be donated. Most of these are good until the end of this month. I've checked most of the dates, and that's about where we are. There are two of these freeze-dried dark chocolate strawberries. Interesting. Whole bunch of protein and just different bars. There's two Luna Bars coconut dipped chocolate. Two of these One Perfect Nutrition Bar Fudge Graham and then Fudge Graham. I guess they got just different styles on there. A lot of these I don't or can't have because I do keto. But I did find a couple things I could keep. They have these Go Macro Bars. Um, there are six of the Protein Pleasure Peanut Butter Chocolate Chip. Um, and then, let's see, six of the Prolonged Power Banana and Almond Butter. That really sounds good. Got some Cliff Bars. We have one coconut almond bar, three peanut butter, and four of the chocolate peanut butter. Pretty good. S uh, not six, five of these Luna Protein Bars chocolate chip cookie dough. Uh, the carbs in these are 39. Ouch. So we'll not be eating those. <laughs> I have been finding a lot of beef jerky uh, lately. I got these. There's two of the uncured bacon, two chipotle, and I believe the last five are uncured pepperoni. Um, I have been finding some makeup in uh, type items too. So we have this uh, Born to Glow. I don't know what it is. It's a uh, concealer. These are so stupid. <laughs> I Sorry, if you like these, I apologize. This J Duo sided face roller. You like put it in the fridge and it gets cold and then you roll it on your skin and you're supposed to feel great about yourself. That's, uh, we'll just go with that. <laughs> Two packages of these little non-slip grip clips. Say that ten times fast. I love these. I think the package was coming open. That's the only reason they're all still in there. The Biore value-sized 18 deep cleansing pore strips. 18, that's good. There's two of these compact mirrors. Every day I'm hustling. There are two of these uh, real thick 
hair nets. These are things that I can definitely put in that pantry bin. Um, personal care items do really well in there. Have two boxes of Skinny Pop popcorn butter flavor. Also managed to find, um, I don't know how to say this, so I apologize. <laughs> Uh, this one is a dry fast top coat. This one is a crystal clear base coat. This one is a nail strengthener by OPI, which I am going to keep. And then this is the same brand of the nail polish. Um, it looks kind of white, but it does have a pale pink to it. It is, what does it say? Blah, 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 blah. Susie Chases. Okay, let's go with that. So I believe that is all on this side of the table. Yeah, these. These I can have. These are, I don't know if I'm going to like them. These, oh, they're sriracha. They might be hot. So this is a 100% real natural chicken uh, sriracha. It's like this bar looking thing. They have two carbs and two fibers. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Three, six, nine, twelve of them. So that's pretty good, and free is even better. Um, the rest of these items are Dollar Tree. This is only probably less, maybe 15%, 20% of what was in there. Insane. So let me show you down here what I got first. I got uh, this entire bag of Peeps. These are good till next year. What I will do is immediately be putting some of these in the pantry box. What I usually do is just pop this in my car, and then when I go by, I just take several handfuls of, of the things I have to put out and put it in there, and it's a street I travel down all the time, so I could just pop over there and drop some in. We have some, I think, what do we got? Blue, yellow, purple, and pink. I think they all taste the same. They're just different colors. I think it's funny how they say gluten-free, in case you didn't know. Um, these are kind of an awesome find. They are plastic, but they look like little mason jars. It says craft bottle, so you could decorate it in some fashion. And it says happy Easter. So they had to get rid of them because, of course, it says Easter. But there are 16 of those in there. I'm probably going to put one of the other things I found in there and sell it maybe next year. But I will show you that next Actually, this <laughs> is crazy. I had to open this because it was taped closed. This literally has tricolor Easter grass and or stuffer or whatever you want to call them. So they have three colors, the yellow, pink, and green. There are, I believe, I saw it somewhere on here, like 60. Where does it say? Yep, 60 pieces. So I was like, what in the heck am I going to do with this? And since I do sell stuff on eBay, I thought this might be good filler for when I'm shipping something. Um, it's better than going in a landfill right away anyway, huh? So that is just insane. So yeah, I will definitely use those for myself. Always looking for packing material. I find bubble wrap. In fact, I don't think I've ever had to buy bubble wrap. I find big, I find small, I found bags. Uh, you name it, I find it, and I reuse it. So that was a pretty good score. Um, let me see, what else? Uh, we have one Russell Stover white fudge bunny rabbit. Not melted or squished. We have two bags of these, uh, I like how it says milk chocolate, flavored. <laughs> so two bags of those. I got these little things. I guess you stick them into the ground. I think there's four or five of those little bunnies. Um, some treat bags, some little peeps, uh, you know, headband. Isn't that cute? We have two, four, six, seven of these little cartons with eggs. I'm sure I can repurpose these and use those next year. Or I usually uh, will find uh, the little wire baskets that are shaped like a hen. So put a whole bunch of these in there. That'll look great. Maybe not purple, but some of the other colors will do fine. We got these two of these flying discs with a carrot on them. Uh, these are little rubber stamps. They have carrots and bunnies and eggs. Happy Easter, etc. 
this is a big basket. They did have a whole bunch of these baskets in there. <clears throat> and then, of course, you buy the bag. You put your stuff in there. Um, so this is a really big bag. Uh, it says there's two of them in there. These are little craft kits. Um, just very simple felt crafts. Uh, they have the little sheep on them. You put his little feet on and a bow. So that's basically what they are. There are six in each, and I have, goodness, one, two, three, four, five, six. And then these are little duckies. You put their feet and their bow in. And there are, what, four of those. And then these are bunnies, again, you put her belly and little cheeky things. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, there's Inky, <laughs> seven, eight, nine, ten of those, and there's six, that's sixty of those. Um, I don't know, just might redonate. A lot of the stuff um, I can use, a lot of it I can't. This I definitely can use, these in some capacity. This I had to open again, this was a bags and tissue i thought it was just bags so it says 36 piece but each one has two so there's some like ones that have bunnies but they're stripes and like chevron and i guess is there tissue inside of the bag or at the bottom of the bag or box look at that cute oh so yeah, that is pretty cool. I can definitely use those uh, for some purpose. <laughs> these, I'm going to end up just donating or doing something with these. These are little clip-on bunny tails. Do you need a whole case of them? <laughs> so they just have a little clip. And there are, how many in here? Clip-on bunny tail. I don't see. 36. You know what? I think a lot of these have 36. There's 36 in here of these little bunny-shaped crayons. Aren't they adorable? Wouldn't these look cute to put in the little plastic jars that look like mason jars? But again, that's full. This one, this one is still sealed. And this one I opened to make sure what it was, of course, even though there's a picture. There's what's inside. They are baskets. They have pink turquoise, yellow, and purple. This is what they look like. They're just their basic plastic baskets you can use for organizing, but of course, since it says Easter basket, they can't use them. Uh, you could, you know, take that off and just use them as they are. Very cool. So definitely was happy to pick those up. They just have like this butterfly and little star. I mean, I don't think any of them have bunnies, do they? I don't know. I guess I didn't know. They look all the same. Yeah, so, yeah, so I have, what, 36 and 36? That is a lot. So, what, like 72? That's crazy. Um, and the last items that I found was this enormous bag of popcorn. Mm. This was at CVS. This was at a different CVS. But we have bags of white cheddar. As you can see, these are good until May 6, 2020. And then these are also cheese. No, these are butter, and we have white white cheddar, but I don't think there's any other flavors. But, yeah. So, I will be donating those as well, because I don't eat that on keto either. So, pretty crazy amount of stuff I found. Please give this video a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Do you dumpster dive? Are you curious? Would you like to, but you just can't quite bring yourself to it? Uh, some of these stores have been open because they are considered essential in my state, but um, Dollar Tree is CVS. Of course, all the drug stores are. Um, there are a few stores that I have been looking in their dumpster, even though they're not open. They do have people moving product and opening things in the store, uh, workers. So, yeah. And there's one more thing I almost forgot to show you, and I'm going to show you that next. Okay, this is the back of my car. I did not want to bother <laughs> pulling it all out to drag into the house to show you. As you can tell, these uh, these are good on just this month. 
Uh, so we have, let's see, small, I think this is puppy food, dog food, dog food, and I think these, this one here might be, that's dog food and cat food. So that's what, two, four, six, like eight bags. So what I do with these is I either donate them to the shelter and they have been on and off accepting donations because of uh, all the, the virus and stuff that's going around. And uh, then usually by word of mouth, I'll let people know. And if they still can't use it, then I will go ahead and ask uh, on uh, Craigslist or Facebook, say, hey, I got dog food for this particular, you know, small or puppy you know, or cat. What can you use? And I've already given away a lot of bags that way. So keeping it out of the landfill and helping people who in these tough times are not able to feed their animals so it's a win-win for everybody so again i hope you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up leave a comment down below make sure you subscribe if you haven't already because i do so many other things on this channel other than dumpster diving many many hauls thrift stores garage sales auctions i'm a reseller and uh, I'm always looking for stuff to pedal, and if I can't do that, I can give it away, but we're saving it from a landfill, and that makes me very happy. So again, I will see you guys next time, and until then, happy picking! Bye!